We know abortion is wrong and it's important. We know exactly why it's wrong. Babies are designed by God. They are formed. They are created. They are knit together. They are woven together. Jeremiah 1.5, before I formed you in the womb, I knew you. Before you were born, I set you apart. Psalm 139.13, for you created my inmost being. You knit me together in my mother's womb. I praise you because I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Your works are wonderful. I know that full well. My frame was not hidden from you when I was made in the secret place, when I was woven together in the depths of the earth. Your eyes saw my unformed body. All the days ordained for me were written in your book before one of them came to be. Before. Every word that God speaks comes to so we can only imagine how he feels to put so much planning and thought and dedication and love into his creation to have his plans dash before the child has their God-given right to live. God had plans, a specific design, purpose, life, footsteps. God had an entire path ready for this child before the child was even conceived, before the child was ever in utero. The child lived because what God speaks comes forth. It is our right to live, to be free, to have joy. These are our rights given to us from God in Jesus' name. Abortion goes against the free will of the child who was created well before he or she was, with ever, with, was ever within their mother. Both Jesus and John leapt for joy in utero, which tells us that every single person God has formed and designed and created and knit and woven, they all have great purpose on this earth. For God has no favorites. God called Jesus his chosen one, which is why we are chosen, just a side note, because of his spirit within us. This is the outline of his great plan and ordination for every baby, for every abortion, that specific, intricate, pre-chosen destiny is aborted. Luke 1, 41. When Elizabeth heard Mary's greeting, the baby leapt in her womb, and Elizabeth was filled with the Holy Spirit. In a loud voice, she exclaimed, Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the child you will bear. But why am I so favored that the mother of my Lord should come to me? As soon as the sound of your greeting reached my ears, the baby in my womb leapt for joy.